We're now standing across from the Knesset, the Israeli House of Representatives, the government, where well, the decisions are made by 120 people chosen to lead. The number 120 is taken from the number of people who had seats on the Sanhedrin. So you can see there's a mix between historical symbols, between the way that Judaism was and the way that it's run today. And one of those symbols which I want to show you is the seven stem menorah behind me. If you go to Rome, you'll see the same type of menorah, but raised on the, shoulder, on the shoulders of soldiers after the destruction of the Second Temple in 70 AD on the Arch of Titus. When the country began establishing itself, it became a symbol of the newfound freedom and the newly established state of Israel. And you can see it here across from the Knesset, whose symbol it has become. And it's actually become a symbol of the country as well. Upon the menorah, there are little, um, sim there are little stories where you can see different points in the history of the Jewish people. And I dare you to see how many of them you can recognize.